Hey everyone, I'm excited to introduce Blemish Pro Volume 2. Volume 1 was a huge success, and I'm excited to share over 150 new professional grunge maps in Volume 2. We also have some new features that I'll share with you. These maps can be used in your Roughness channel to give objects scratches, smudges, grime, and lots of realism. These maps are all 8K resolution, so you can zoom way in and still get a really beautiful and clean result. And they're also 16-bit, so there's a lot of information to help you as you dial in your renders. These are all seamless, except for a couple of the paper ones, and you can use these in any render engine or 3D application. And there's a lot of versatility. Since they are 8K, you can zoom way in, and since they're tileable, you could also make them very small if you want to. And if you want to take things to the next level, you can even use multiple maps stacked on top of each other, and you can do this by overlaying them in Photoshop and saving them out, or you can do it right in your render engine. For instance, using this map with particles, you can have literally millions of particles just with that one texture, and it's going to render in seconds. So it's a really powerful way to add a lot of detail. We're including something new in Blemish 2, which we're calling progressive stripping. Here's how it works. If we look at, say, dry water, you can see that we have the exact same pattern, but on each map it gets progressively more damaged or worn. And this is really handy to get incredibly realistic renders. So, for example, if you have an object that has three different layers or materials, so say it has a plastic outer shell material, and then the middle material is a rust proofing layer, and finally the bottom, the base layer, would be a metal. So this would be something you would see on a physical real world object. Well, you can use the progressive stripping maps to have the bottom material lightly damaged and then the middle material progressively more damaged and the top material very damaged. And this is going to give the illusion that as the object sustains more damage over time, it slowly reveals the layers further underneath. And this subtle realism is made possible with the progressive stripping of these maps, and it's an incredibly powerful feature. The difference between a decent render and a photoreal render is always in the little details, and this product's gonna help you dial that in with a few clicks. The world is imperfect, and that's just how we like it. I hope you find Blemish Pro Volume 2 useful. Good luck with your projects. Cheers.